Hey guys, haven't done a video in a while. We're just gonna give you a real quick tour of what things look like around here at Powell Rodeo Co. So here you see we're on the trailer. You hop off into the sweet tub here. You got it all curtained it off. And just inside that loading alley is what we call our couching. This has got all of our foods, every type of supplement that we feed everybody. We have our head chute here with our vet alley. Then inside we have Smokey Joe. Hey buddy. We have our two 16 by 16 indoor pens for water. We got night and prom date in this pen here. Got these guys locked up. Might do a little work with them later. And then you go through this gate here at the end of the alley. shutting things behind me here and unfortunately this alley out here is still a little bit muddy Michigan happens find somewhere to set my Pepsi you would think we'd have built something for that by now so you see we use curtains quite a bit here our theory behind that is, is if the bulls can't see through it they're not gonna try to go through it Plus, if you happen to be walking by, you'll see some curtains back here in our back pens too. If you happen to be walking by a pen and one kicks at you, 71 prom date there's pretty famous for that. It keeps you from getting, the bull's hoof will hit that curtain and it won't come out and get you. So as you can see, we're out here to the first set of arches. We can send bulls down to the second set of arches. Those go to our two 24 by 24 outdoor pens. Or we can send them up this way into our back pens out here. We've got four lefts, four rights, two 8x10s and two 8x8s on each side. One big dump pen. I really couldn't tell you how big it is. It's just gates to fit. Our right handed load up for strip and shoot. The left handed load up. And then our left pen's out here. So as you can see, we can run bulls from those two big 24 by 24s clear up into here. And out here, is our newly expanded 50 by 50 arena. One left-handed shoot, one right-hand shoot. Over in this corner, we've got our barrels and stuff for Julie to ride her horse, bull barrel, rope and dummy, the rake equipment, the works. You can see both of our chutes have got these crash pads up here. They feel a whole lot better to bounce your noggin off of than steel. And then same thing over here. And this is kind of where we all walk in and out down that alleyway there. Got steps with a handrail, some tie ropes. Our all important bench where we set our stereo when we're out here working. You cannot do anything without a stereo. Finally, we got the arena dry. The alleyways are still pretty deep, but we've been working our tails off trying to get this arena to dry. Our brand new light tower here. We've got five of the LED. I think they're 2600 watt lights and then we got three of the special effects lights there on the bottom you can see out here is our pasture thought captain jack was out there but he must be up and over the hill now you notice we've got two water tanks one in each pen in the barn we've got one in each of these big outside pens then we've got the great big guy out here in the pasture so well, folks, that does it for today's update. Just wanted to tune in and do a little something different. Being that we're here stuck at home in the quarantine, hope you all stay safe out there. We'll see you on the flip side.